the young men of the cave that slept for over 300 years. The Holy Quran shares a story about a group of young righteous men that believed and worshipped in the one true God. They were living in a society that worshipped idols. Because this group of young men refused to take their society's idols as gods, their family and community expelled them, and their powerful king wanted them killed. The young men tried to flee. They fled to a cave in a mountain without much wealth, food, and resources. They realized if they find them, they would either kill them or force them to join their way of idol worship. As they entered the cave, while scared, made a dua to Allah asking Him for His mercy, and to make their efforts straight, to make it proper, to find a way out of the ordeal they are in. The young men discussed, how can their people worship idols without there being evidence that they're God? Allah the Almighty then gifted them one of His miracles, causing them to fall into a deep sleep in the cave for 309 years, along with their dog who sat in front of the entrance. They were laying down with their eyes open, and Allah caused them to turn from right to left in their sleep. The sun helped aid and preserve their bodies as they sleep. When they woke up, they discussed how long they slept. They stated, Perhaps we slept for a day and a half. Allah knows. They were hungry, so they sent one of them to go buy some halal food without causing any attention. They did not know it was 309 years later, so there are different people out there. It's a different society, and this society did not worship idols. One of them went down to buy food wearing clothes worn 300 years ago. The young man from the cave handed his currency coin to the store owner, who saw the coin and he did not recognize the coin, since it's now over 300 years later, and they now use different types of coins. The store owner said, You must have found some treasure. The bishop of the city spoke with the young man from the cave, who then brought the bishop to the rest of the young men in the cave. Then Allah caused the young men from the cave to pass away a natural death. This was a sign to the people that God's promise is always true. The people then debated what they should do with their bodies.